Hey guys, Cynical Manor here, and today we're going to be doing the air-to-air uh, -air restart in the Mirage. This is probably going to be the final video of this series. Uh, I'll be starting a new series soon, um, so let me know what you want to see uh, as far as that goes, uh, whether it be a jet or a helicopter or whatever. Just let me know what you guys uh, would like me to start on next. Um, of course, we'll revisit the Mirage in the future if there's any updates or anything like that. Uh, but as far as it goes right now. I've pretty much covered everything that I can think of on the uh, on the jet so far. Um, so this is the last one. This is going to be the air to air restart. Um, and right now we're just in the climb to get some altitude to show you how to do it. But uh, I'll come out of the climb now, and we'll go ahead and level out level out the uh, aircraft. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to reach over and I'm going to turn all the fuel off. Oops. If I get the switch to pull here. Ah. Well, I can't get that switch. There we go. Alright. So we'll put the uh, uh, throttle to idle. You see the RPMs dropping. There goes the generators. So we'll just put the, no the nose of the aircraft down. Shut off that warning. We'll go over to the left here. There's a little switch called the uh, engine in-flight air-to-air restart. We'll click that and we'll pull the throttle back to idle. And once we see the RPMs start to rise here, I uh, might want to turn all the fuel on. That'd probably be helpful. There we go. And we'll just slowly increase fuel or throttle until everything comes back online. Now, if you noticed, if you watched a previous video of mine, the uh, airfield strike, you noticed that we had a afterburner issue. It was the afterburner was stuck on, so I shut the engines down, tried to restart it. The the regular way and it didn't work so maybe if I'd have known how to use the air to um, the air to air restart um, uh, it may have worked but one thing I have noticed um, in this aircraft is that when it gets to zero uh, on the tachometer the aircraft does not want to restart um, so keep that in mind um, I'll try to simulate it again Matter of fact, I'll kill the engines and level out just a little bit. See if I can get it to do that. But I've had no luck with restarting this aircraft. Let's see if we can get it to uh, to zero there. And I'll come back to you when it's when it's at zero. All right, so we're at zero, and I'm going to show you that generally uh, I have had no luck trying to get this thing restarted. So we'll turn all the fuel back on. We'll go ahead and hit the uh, air to air restart switch. Pull that out of the idle detent. I don't want you to watch something here. We're going to come over here and we're going to go in the red. It's like it hot starts. Boom. So it's like the aircraft will not restart once she goes past. I guess it's about, a, about 11. Yeah, about 11. So, you see we're smoking now. So we've hot started. 
So now the engines are toast. Pretty sure. Try it again. Yeah, and it's just smoking. So, if you know how to do that, let me know. But anything, like I said, anything under about 12, 12%, um, you know, because when you're starting the aircraft, 11%, you introduce fuel, and she comes online. But we're at throttle, I mean idle. Uh, I'll even go for full power, nothing. So, turn the starter switch on and off. I'll even try to start it the old way and see. Might get the cover to lift. Lift up here. There we go. Yeah, it's nothing. It's like a hot start. It's like it's the engines have hot started, but they've not started. So at this point, we're, all we can say is, um goodbye <laughs> and just bail out so we'll say toodaloo to the old mirage there as we parachute down to earth So, I hope you've enjoyed the series. I've enjoyed making it. Let me know what you guys want to see for the next series. Uh, and I'll do my best to make it great. Or as great as I can. So, thanks for watching. We'll see you again. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And you guys have a good one.